16 years behind bars for the former reality TV show star found guilty of killing a Coast Guardsman in a DUI crash. Uh, this afternoon, a court sentenced Melissa Hancock. Virginia Beach police say that the Little Women Atlanta cast member killed Daniel Dill in a wrong way crash at the oceanfront in 2017. Tony Newsom's Jason Marks has been on top of this case since the beginning. And he is live outside the beach courthouse with details. Jason. Guys, it was so emotional in that courtroom today. Lots of tears when talking about Daniel Dill's life and what could have been had Melissa Hancock just made the right choices. It's been brutal. It's been devastating to the entire family. 29-year-old Daniel Dill isn't the face of drinking and driving. In fact, he didn't drink at all, but his life was taken because someone else did. Yeah, that's the irony that makes it so painful. It's one of the, you know, how do you justify it? How do you explain that? You know, a teachable moment. What do we teach the kids? You know, I'm going to be the drunk driver. They live. Last November, Dill was on his way to pick up his wife, Natalie, who was out with friends celebrating her birthday. That's when Melissa Hancock left an oceanfront bar drunk, drove the wrong way down Interstate 264, and hit Dill's car head on. Dill died from his injuries. The heartbreak uh, of missing Dan is never going to end. Today, Hancock was sentenced to 16 years in prison for her actions. She sobbed and told the court that she didn't believe what she did and that she'll never be able to forgive herself. But n not once did she say, I'm sorry. So I think that really bothered me. I got to tell you, my opinion hasn't changed. It was very emotional listening to her, but I, I just, I don't care. I don't care her, what her position is or how she feels. Hancock, who has dwarfism, had a 0.19 blood alcohol level when she got behind that wheel. Dill's family says that Hancock sits behind bars they'll try to begin healing. For the last 11 months, I haven't really had much control over my life or like what happens, you know. So it's just now trying to find a way to, to try to live my life again. And family hopes that those 16 years will serve as a message to anyone who wants to get behind the wheel drunk. They say, remember what happened to Daniel Dill. That's the latest here in Virginia Beach. Chase Marks, 10 on your side.